Hi guys, Flying Fish here, and welcome back to some more Dokkan Battle, and we have a new sort of challenge event right here. So this is New Namek's Threat Breakthrough the Super Armor, and it looks to be one of those kinds of events where uh, you have to take down as many of these, um, these like Cyclopean guards as possible. So They've done this before, the uh, event sort of like this. Well, I'm assuming it's like this, so uh, I may eat my words in a little bit, but I'm pretty sure uh, this is just like an event we got, um, what was it, like a year ago now? Um, so there was this like event related to like Resurrection of F that came around with um, the, I don't know what celebration it was. It was this, it, whatever celebration gave us the story event with uh, the free to play Tech Golden Frieza and Sorbet. It was that event that gave us a stage where we had to fight Frieza soldiers. And the event, the way it worked was it looked just like this. So we'd been we'd be faced off against a number of enemies, and then we'd have a certain number of turns that we have to defeat them under. And then like they don't like they don't hit hard at all. But every phase, they get like more and more HP, a damage reduction, and you have less turns to finish them all off. And it looks like they're following the same formula here. So phases one and two, you'll have three turns to finish all five enemies off. Phases three and four, you'll have two turns to finish them off. And then the final stage, stage five, uh, you will have one turn to finish them all off. And in that phase, they have the, like, the most amount of HP and damage reduction. So, doing this in under one turn can be very difficult. Especially if you have a bad rotation, because it's like, you go in here with, like, the wrong rotation, and it's like, well, you're, <laughs> you're just screwed. And in order to clear all the missions, you have to defeat all the guards in each phase. And you get some pretty good rewards from this, I do think. Yeah, we get stones. Um, Grand Kai's, Elder Kai's, a lot of good stuff here. I think this is like 30 stones in total. So, all right, this is an event that's going to be very annoying for some people. So we're going to jump right into this and hopefully um, uh, we can get this done uh, pretty nicely. <laughs> and I'm going to show you guys some keys and how to um, handle this well. So we are able to bring a couple items here. So this is the AGL stage. So we're going to want to bring, uh, wait, versus it. No, this is versus AGL. Okay, yeah. keep in mind about that. This is versus AGL. So we're going to want to bring tech. Uh, where's my tech? Okay, so this is the tech team I'm running. I'm running the LR gods as leader because they're the 200% leader skill is very, very good here. I'm also bringing Goku. I'm bringing the Gobros as well because of their additional attacks. Same for Gohan and uh, Gogeta. And Tech God Goku, he's here mostly for his, uh, both his orb changing and how well he's linking with the gods. So I think this is going to go well. I think we can get this done in one try here, uh, you know, with luck. So we're going to bring a couple items right here. Uh, Takoyaki is one item. It's changing uh, tech key spheres, or randomly changing key spheres to tech. And then it's giving um, allies attack 5% for tech keys fear obtained. And then I'm also bringing the Chi Lai, which is the same thing, but for AGL orbs. Because it doesn't really matter what orbs these characters collect. Like, even though they're tech types, like, we're not running a nuking leader. Because I'm pretty sure they're actually banned from here. Um, I'm pretty sure they are. They were banned in the last one, I think. Well, okay, I, I have no idea. We'll check later, but yeah, the thing is we're, we have to go through five phases here So it's probably better that you don't bring the nuking leaders because you might you're probably gonna struggle for key at points and you're gonna Possibly waste your turns and have to use items before you get to the final stage. So yeah, we don't want that happening. So We're gonna jump straight in with this. This should be pretty easy oh, It'll take more than a standard tax to mash these metal hands it's the armor. Dang near impenetrable. Focus all your key on the point of impact. <coughs> My voice. Ah. Okay, so here we go. So yeah, it's five enemies right here. Uh, this versus AGL, so they are obviously AGL enemies. 
So, all right, let's get our rotation set up right here. Um, probably gonna leave them linked up together. Uh, I'm assuming these enemies don't have much health right now because this is only the first phase. So this should be pretty standard going through here. So let's see, um, does this finish? Oh, <laughs> yeah, oh yeah. Um, also, um, in these phases, um, these type advantage, adva advantageous characters uh, do have especially more attack against these guys. So you can bring characters of other typing, but they're gonna be doing like greatly reduced damage. So yeah, you're, you'll you'll want to bring as many same uh, the type effective characters as you can. Oh, we just one turned them here. Okay, that's good. I didn't even think we were gonna do that this time, but we got lucky. Okay. Oh uh, yeah. So yeah, that's that's why I was saying this is probably gonna be annoying for some people. Well, I mean, uh, like, getting the, like, bad rotations aside, it's like, like, some people, like, if you're missing some of these, like, optimal characters in order to get this done, you're, like, like, in, like, probably just gonna be impossible for you guys to beat this. Okay, so it looks like these characters have, like, probably, like, four million health or something? Uh, okay, double super from the Gobros. Let's go, let's go. Uh, like the Gobros. Gobros are gonna be amazing here. The gods are gonna be amazing here because they're doing the guaranteed additional with more than 18 key. Yeah, see? Yeah, see? We, we won. We won this turn because of this. So, missing some of these key characters is gonna be, uh, very... It's not gonna be good for some people. Oh, it's really not gonna be good for some people, I should say. Uh, all right, I think I'm gonna float God Goku off. Uh, that, no, I'm, 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 I'm okay. Uh, I'm just worried that like we might get like a situation where like say there's like one enemy left and I don't think God Goku is gonna exactly have the attack necessary to finish them off. Yeah, I was thinking of floating off uh, Carnival Super Saiyan Goku because he doesn't have he doesn't have additional built in, right? I think I think he only has like the five additional from my uh, the skill orb I put on him. Okay, yeah, additional additional from them. Let's go. Okay, is this enough? Will this be enough to finish? Let's see. How much health do these? Um, so we're in stage three now. So let's see. Okay, so it's hard to say exactly. Um, maybe like five million HP they've got. Uh, perhaps. Um, okay, yeah. See, not one of them lived now. Okay. Oh, and we can transform with the gods too. That's very, uh, that'll be very fun. Um, oh man, I should, I should leave. They don't link the best together, but um, I can rely on them for their additionals way more than, than this boy right here. So I guess let's let's just keep going. Uh, we're gonna have one more phase of these like moderately difficult Cyclopean guards, and then after that we will have that. There will be the final final phase. And that's when we can just, like, pop all our items and get full orbs and just hopefully just dominate them. <laughs> okay, um, let's float off, um, oh, ooh, but Gogeta, um, Gogeta, does Gogeta have a built-in additionals? He should, right? No, he doesn't. What the? I swear, some of these characters, I swear I thought some of them had additionals and they just don't. All right, wow, well, okay, that's, that, that's lame. That's really lame, actually, so... Uh, looks like we'll be better off just um, leaving them untransformed for now. So we still have the additional from their uh, kit, you know. Oh, wow. This this might take a while. I'm I'm probably not going to show all of this for all the teams. I'll probably just cut the, like, the last few phases. Um, okay, yeah. There's an additional. There's an additional. Okay, so that's, we're about to waste a god super attack. Awesome. Uh, yeah, could have played that one a little better. Uh, we'll, still, we'll still finish them off next turn, so it'll be fine. Okay, so let's see. Our final turn. I, I think our final turn is going to be the gods, Gogeta, and Gohan. All right, that is... Oh, okay, it's not the most ideal final turn I would have liked, but we can get lucky. <laughs> we can get lucky and it can work. So let's just wrap this up right here. All right, okay. Uh, there is woodpeckers right outside the wall. Um, Hurry, it's okay. It's just a woodpecker. Okay, all right, all right, all right. Um, so yeah, okay. Uh, let's transform the gods right now, and hopefully we will have the luck to finish this off right here. Woo! 
Okay, unfortunately, we don't have their active skills because, you know, none of these enemies are below 50% HP and we're absolutely not below 50%. So, all right, we are going to need very good luck right here. So let's pop uh, this Takoyaki. Please change the orbs good. Oh, that's not what we like to see. Uh, wow, that was pretty awful, actually. Uh, actually, I think I might just reset the app because that was so terrible. All right, I'll be right back. Um, yeah, if you guys don't know, um, if you get, like, bad orbs with your item, you can, um, hop out and jump right back in. And if you change the, like, the location of, like, your units, uh, the outcome you get from the orb changing will be different. Let's just get the active skill really quick. Okay, let's see. Hopefully, come on, give us something. Come, give us better orbs right here than that garbage. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Yeah, that's what we... <laughs> yeah, that's what we prefer to see. So, I think I'm going to attack with Gohan first, actually. And we'll target this last guy right here. So, we'll get him out of there. And then, uh, hopefully, uh, we get some good orb changing. Come on. That is not what I like to see. Uh, Chilai, come on, come through. Wow, that is awful, thank you. Uh, let's just pop the last one, whatever. Wow, nothing! I'm so lucky, guys! I love this! Uh, you know what, I'm not, I'm not doing this event again, hang on. Okay, I literally just can't find the combination again that got me all the- I hate- I hate these stupid items so much! Look at this! Like, oh wow, there we go, finally! Yeah! Whatever, whatever, whatever... There we go, I, okay, I figured it out, alright. Let's target this last guy, and let's switch these two, and then let's try a- try a chi lie, I guess. Oh, perfect! That's what I like- that's what I wanted! That's exactly what I wanted! <sighs> well, I'm just gonna rely on them to kill. So, cause whatever, and give me nothing, you give me nothing, okay. Alright, alright, well here we go, yeah. Can you see where the annoying part comes in? Can you guys see that? Okay, well hopefully, uh, we can just, please just give us additionals and we don't have to touch this again with this team, please. I just want to get out of here. Um, you should be dead, yep, Addi okay, we're gonna do this, okay. So, gonna need the gods to do, uh, triple super, or I'm gonna need, um, Gogeta to double super, if these guys only double super. So, let's see, um, let's see how this goes, um, okay, we won, alright. <laughs> Probably, we probably won. I think 7 million is enough. It should be enough. Yeah, okay. Oh, boy. Oh, that sucked. That sucked. What's wrong? Out of batteries? <laughs> Beep. Beep. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, Piccolo, just take credit for the win, I guess. Whatever. Yeah, there we go. So yeah, um, that's what you gotta do to win. Yeah, um, yeah, uh, personally... I am not the biggest fan of these events, but, uh, hey, we got through it. Yeah, so there we go. That's the AGL. Uh, now we have to do this four more times. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Um, cool. Um, uh, I'm going to jump right into these. I will, um, I'll quickly show my teams that I'm using, and then I'll just, like, cut back to when we're, like, done. So, okay, this is a team I'm running for the tech phase, and no. And my plan here is is to rely on blue evolution vegeta and his final explosion active skill because it's only when hp is 50 percent or higher starting from the fourth turn and it does damage to all enemies so we're gonna be relying on that for like the final phases and then i also brought some like int characters here like 17 uh ui goku for links uh roshi and tien and ui goku are here for their support and then also you just in case, uh, you know, like the active skill doesn't finish them off. So I think ideally we will, we'd probably want to get both um, blue evolution Vegetas in the same rotation for the last fight. But we'll we'll just see how this plays out. And we're going to bring the Monaka head and uh, Deborah cookie because uh, whatever. <laughs> Ever. Actually, hang on. Let me I'm going to grab this. I'm going to bring this support memory. The. Uh, Zeno, Zeno support memory. This is giving Universe Survival Saga category allies attack and defense 10% in battle. So hopefully that'll help us out too. So, all right, here we go. I'm going to jump right in 
and we will cut back when we are in the final fight. Um, well, um, there you go. I beat the SDR stage, or the physical stage, I mean. Um, yes, I know I did say I was gonna do it with the Int team, but, um, it did not play out that way. It turns out I have, um, awful luck, it would seem. So yeah, there we go. There's the, um, SDR, SDR one. Uh, well, I've got three more to do, and I've been recording for a about an hour now, yeah, so, um, uh, yeah. Um, oh, right, uh, I was gonna say, um, so, strategy for the, um, SDR stage that I did was running a full, well, obviously, full SDR team, but, um, really, it was just SDR LR Broly, the, the king, the monster who did all the work there. Uh, if you have him, absolutely run him. There's, like, no... He's <laughs> he's such an easy win there. But, um, otherwise, if you do not have him, then probably I'd say maybe, like... Um, there's, uh, there's an SDR Piccolo. Um, uh, not the, not the new one, the old one who just easy aid. Um, oh, that's wonderful. Um, well, the old one is just easy aid, and he's an AoE unit, so he could also work very, very well there. Uh, so, yeah, and I'm running an LR Broly friend. If you can find an LR Broly friend, that also will help out a lot, even if you don't have him yourself. And then for this AGL phase, which I luckily just overkilled right there, um, I, I just relied on Majin Vegeta, his AoE attack from his 18 key, uh, does really really monstrous damage to these guys so yeah uh you want to run him um otherwise there are some other um AG agl aoe units that i was thinking of running oh um the agl go tanks the super saiyan go tanks and ghosts and the uh well he's not an aoe unit but ui goku uh with all his additionals he can do he could also work very well here uh, if you don't have Majin Vegeta, uh, if you do have Majin Vegeta, and you can find the Majin Vegeta friend, it is a uh, very, very, um, sort of guaranteed victory for you there, you know, as long as you get some good orb changing with the, uh, you know, the items, um, alright, um, next I'm going to do the int in tech phases, um, for the, so for my physical team, I'll show you guys quickly what the physical team I'm running is. Uh, so this is a physical team I'm running. Uh, yeah, chat it, sweep, whatever. Uh, the real king in this event is going to be Physical Cell. Uh, however, I'm not too sure about... See, the hard thing with him is that I cannot rely on these support items because uh, he only does his AoE uh, in his 12 to 17 key. So wait, I can't rely on grabbing a whole bunch of key spheres with him. So I, it might actually be worth it to replace one of these with just like a like a Bulma item. You know, the Bulma item to increase your ally's attack. Uh, or if you could find a friend LR cell, uh, which is ideal, which obviously I don't have one here. Uh, running him as a friend would be good too. If you float off the friend cell, in the second turn of the third phase, assuming you beat the fourth phase with it in the two turns and not in one turn, uh, by the time you get to the fifth turn, you'll have um, both LR cells in the same rotation. If if you know he was, you kept him on rotation and floated the other one off in the second turn of the third phase. Um, that's actually what I tried doing with uh, this team. However, I got unlucky, and I had a uh, rotation of these three idiots, and I was not able to finish the enemies off. So, yeah, that was like half hour of the video, so, um, 
yeah, uh, whenever I find a friend, I will be right back and we will uh, finish off these stages. Okay, hey everyone, uh, I'm recording this bit in post, uh, which is something I don't usually do, but I had a small cold for a little bit, so I wasn't really able to record, or at least like narrate over it, so I just recorded these last two stages on their own, and I'm just gonna voice over it for what I was doing, so let's take a look at it right here, so I finally got around to completing the int phase, uh, you might notice in the corner I made a few different changes to my team. I I removed the the support units for the Tournament of Power on here, the Tech, Roshi, and Tian, and the physical UI Goku, and just replaced them with um, strong int characters who are on uh, Vegeta's category. And also, instead of trying to get both Vegetas in the... Uh, same turn for here. I just was like, you know what? We're just gonna get one and just see how it goes and In the end it turns out it worked out for us because we took out two of them right here And now we've only got three enemies left with just a very little bit of HP um, Oh, yeah, and I also have the uh, Super Saiyan Goku on the team too. I forgot if he was um, uh, On here already earlier. It's been like a week since, I <laughs> since what you last seen uh, and I also popped a few items right here just to be sure, you know, you could never be too sure in these stages. I just didn't want to do it again, and like, yeah, UI Goku does an additional, so we're we're sitting really good, so... Uh, yeah, so... It's just, all you need here is luck. And LR Blue Evolution Vegeta, he's, um, that's all you need. <laughs> uh, if you're able to, like, double active skill in the last, um fight, then you'll very easily get it done. Uh, I guess you could aim for that if you want to be safe, but, um, you no, know, I tried to do it and I messed up because I didn't actually kill the enemies in time, so, um, yeah, just did not work out for me. Yeah, here's the team you could see right here. Uh, I brought the Zeno support memory as usual, and I only had to use a couple of the Monaka items, so yeah, um, that is how this worked for me. So that is the, uh, versus tech stage clear, or the int phase, all done. Uh, now let's look at the uh, physical run. So, <laughs> so you might know it. I changed up my physical team completely. It is not nowhere even close to the same team it used to be. So instead of a, um, you know, rocking the extreme team with AOE Cell and Broly and all those wacky characters, um, I decided to go with super physical instead because of well, it was really the seven-year LR that carried me so hard here. Uh, not to mention, we do have some pretty powerful characters here who do uh, additional attacks and stuff. Or AoEs. Well, well, we have Chow Man. Yeah, I actually brought Chow Man here, which is uh, hilarious. He, Chow Man could actually get this done. If you just get like a... You get Chow Man here and just get like a... Change the full field of orbs, maybe? Uh, I think he could, uh, do wonders for you in here. And we get pretty lucky here, too, with some Vegito crits. I- I don't think we would have been able to do this without him, so thankfully it all worked out. Yeah, look at- look at Gogeta here, 14 million. I believe he does also get an additional super here, too. Yeah, okay. See, we didn't even need it here. Or maybe we did. How many enemies left? Just one enemy? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, we might have needed it if Gogeta wouldn't have, like, additional super or something. But, um, thankfully, we got it, and we didn't have to worry about that. So, yeah, there we go. That is the super... Oh, not the super... The versus int the physical stage of the event beaten. Uh, I show the team in just a second here, whenever it's done loading. Uh, alright. So, 7-year LRs, very, very good. Guaranteed additionals, very strong. Uh, Kefla, she's changing orbs, so she could be a really good help. She's also a nuking character, so using the Deborah cookie or the Monaka or those sorts of items, uh, helps out greatly, and I'm not done, Brayden. Knock it off. Um, then Blue Vegito, um, he can do a million bajillion attacks, and he's also got the counters, which work really well here, considering the enemies actually attack you. And then, uh, Dokkan Fest, GT Super Saiyan Goku, who, to be honest, he was really just here as, like, a filler option. Um, same with Gogeta, sort of. The third-year LR, I wasn't really sure, um, 
<laughs> what else to bring here? And then Chow Man, who actually worked pretty well here. Uh, not to mention, he does work because he is on um, the Super Saiyan Force category, the Fusion Fighters. And that was all it took. And we could have had like an even like a better rotation at the end. Like having Chow Man, I would have probably had focused everything on Chow Man, getting him a full field of key uh, if he was around. Uh, Kefla could have been around. Uh, she would have been great. Uh, but thankfully, we did have the seven-year LRs and Blue Vegito here, and they are, you know, they're very, very, very strong. So there you go. That is all the stages for this new uh, sort of event done. And I go through and show you them all right here. Yeah, here's all the missions, all completed. That is everything you need to know about this the stage to get everything done. We collect our rewards right here. 30 stones, I've uh, got some funky Kai's, I uh, got some training items, uh, hourglasses, meat. Yeah, everyone loves a little meat in their lives, don't lie. Uh, Aller Kai's and some Hercule statues, I don't know why they give us five diamond Hercule statues and then five freaking silver ones really make any sense to me, but um, yeah, there we go. Oh, okay, I'm just, okay, I guess I'm wrapping up the video here, so... There you are. That is how you complete all stages of this new fighting robot event. Uh, let me know in the comments how how well you do here. How many, tell me any if you got any funny stories to share. Uh, thank you all so much for watching this video. Please hit the like button and subscribe if you feel like it. I love you all, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.